Hey, what's up guys? Worldwide here. So we got a really good video for you today and this one means a lot to me personally because the darts that we're going to be taking a look at was sent to me as a gift from one of my subscribers and he knew that I was a huge fan of the Ted Hankey darts, the old smoother version. These are the brand new 16 gram multi-ring onyx coated version. So a little bit different, same exact barrel shape. But yeah, he knew that I didn't have this set, sent them to me. And for that, I thank you very much. But yeah, really excited to get these things out of the package. We'll take a close up look over some stats and dimensions and then to the board we go. And I have a feeling these are gonna fly really well, right up my alley, super light, and I love the barrel shape. So here we go. Well, there we go. Your Winmore Ted Hanky darts comes in your standard cardboard hang case. Three barrels, three stems, and three flights. And this is a really nice added feature. It comes with a nice point protector, which is a whole hell of a lot better than those cheap plastic ones that most companies give you. But let's get these things assembled, take a close-up look, and go over some stats and dimensions. Well, there we go. Fully assembled, stock out of the package. And I have to say, wow, that's a great looking dart. We have our black onyx coated barrels. Comes with a medium length prism stem, as well as a standard size prism flight. Running down some stats and dimensions really quick. These are a 90% tungsten barrel and the barrel length 43.3 millimeters long. And the width right at the widest point here, right in the front of the barrel, 6.3 millimeters wide. And that obviously tapers down towards the back of the dart. And these come in spot on right at 16 grams. Super light dart, and that's the actual weight that Ted Hankey throws with. But yeah, let's get a close-up look at these things. Well, there we go. Nice close-up look at the barrels. And I took the stem off of the other one so you could kind of get an idea where the barrel ends. It's hard to tell with these uh, stems here, but quite a contrast to his completely smooth darts that he used to play with. These are a very fine multi-ring grip dart. And uh, I would say the grip level is probably about a two and a half on a scale of one to five. Not that aggressive at all, but it does come off the fingertips really nice. And if you notice, check out these nose cones. Great nose cone there. So you know what that means. I'm going to have to throw on a set of the Winmore Free Flow points. I want to get rid of that lip and have a perfect transition. So let me install these points and we'll come right back. I'll show you the setup that I'm going to use for the throwing part of the video. And straight to the board we go. Well, there we go. The free flow points installed like a dream. Couldn't have been easier. And check that out. No more lip at all. 100% perfect transition. And what that means, since that lip is now gone from the front of the dart, you're going to experience a lot less wild deflection. The darts are going to glide past one another. And one of the big bonuses I like is that your flights are going to last about 10 times as long. So yeah, what a beautiful looking front end of this dart. Oh, I love that transition. Let me give you a close up of the complete setup and then to the board we go. Well, there we go. There's my setup for the throwing part of this video. And I think Ted Hankey himself would approve of this setup. Look at that. We have our smooth Winmore free flow points. We have our blacked out Cosmo carbon stems as well as the blacked out Superkite air flight. So let's get a quick warm up and then we'll see how these things fly on camera. Here we go. Here we go guys, quick couple minutes with the 16 gram Winmore Ted Hanky darts. And while I'm playing with these lighter darts, I want to discuss what I think is a bit of a myth when it comes to lighter darts. Now I think we've all heard that with a light dart, you have to throw it harder. And if you do miss, you miss by a greater margin. I'm not sure if that's entirely true. Every time I've played with a lighter dart, I just find them so effortless to throw. And what I mean by that, you know, I'm just not talking about a few turns, but if I was to play a long format 501 match, you know, I'm talking a best of nine or a best of 11, I can throw lighter darts just as well at the end of the match as I can in the beginning of the match. Your arm doesn't tire it out. So say if you're playing with a 25, 26 gram dart or something heavier, I think those darts might be okay for like a best of three, but when you start going into a long format, best of nine, best of 11, I think you're gonna start missing by a greater margin as the match wears on. And with lighter darts, you just, uh, you, you always find that same consistency time and time again. And I'm not talking an as extreme a lighter dart as a 16 gram, but I mean, there have been five world champions to use an 18 gram dart or lighter which I think is quite amazing. And the average dart weight 
of the top 32 PDC players is 22 grams. And I honestly do think that means something. I mean, there's not a lot of players out there, a lot of top players using really heavy darts. There are your exceptions though. There's always gonna be your exceptions with anything. Anyway, that's my little rant about light darts. Back to these darts. The grip is phenomenal. I love this mild multi-ring grip. I really thought these were going to be grippier, but they're not at all. They come off the fingertips really nice. They don't stick at all. And these are, like I said earlier, to start the video off, these are extra special because I don't receive gifts too often from subscribers. So, you know, something like this is truly amazing. Oh, is that in 57? 134 maybe? Yeah, 134. But yeah, these fly really nice. The barrel shape is exactly, pretty much the exact same as the smooth 14 gram version. These are just ever so slightly wider in the front, making them even more front heavy. Oh, I forgot to add too, these barrels, similar to the smooth version, almost completely hollow. These are drilled out in the back, something like 26 millimeters deep, which is kind of good. If you had some tungsten putty, you could, you could adjust the weights of these, probably get them up somewhere around 18, 19 grams and anything in between. All right, last one here. Oh, that one stood up on me. Wow, you can see that in the camera. Another 134? No, that's a 96. <clears throat> well, there you go. What do you say we roll into the final clip? And uh, we hope you enjoy this one. with a six mess. Three, three times in a row. <laughs> All right, that was four times in a row. I was trying to duplicate Duplicate the uh, Ted Hankey 170 ending to win his world championships. I was going to lay a soundtrack over that. I can't do it. That's frustrating. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you on the next one, guys. Later. Ah, four times in a row.